the Ida vision for a public accessible mapping site has been achieved. Restoration and recovery mapping for the Missouri River Basin has been compiled into one centralized location and is now available to PDT members, Mr. Rick representatives, and to the general public. Currently, two map views are available, the Missouri River Basin map and the Missouri River Historical map. The Missouri River Basin map view is a base map for the basin and includes features such as aerial photography, public lands, and mitigation sites. This map view gives users the opportunity to view map data throughout the basin, to perform detailed searches of information, and to print customized maps for their use. The Missouri River Historical Map View gives users the ability to visualize the historic Missouri River. Mapping efforts by the Missouri River Commission in 1879 produced historic data sets including detailed land cover along the river as well as identifying historic and cultural features. Original sets of these maps are available through this map view and the 1894 mapping will be available soon. These websites are publishing from the program Central GIS Database, jointly managed by staff in Omaha and Kansas City districts. The map site brings together several components of the Missouri River Recovery Program. Starting with the Mr. Rick map as a template, data layers were prioritized based on Mr. Earp's short-term GIS needs and priority layers identified by Mr. Rick, such as public lands. Functional mapping was developed at the basin-wide scale down to the navigation scale and includes aerial photography. The publishing of historical mapping is an example of a detailed data set that was produced in fiscal year 2009. As was done with the historical mapping, other program data layers and even map views can quickly be published via the site. Furthermore, because the map is published from a common and jointly managed enterprise GIS database, it is also straightforward to quickly deploy maps for other projects. This example is what Ida accomplished for the Missouri River Authorized Purposes Study. In fiscal year 2010, IDA plans to post additional data layers and map views. Your feedback and your priorities are very important. PDT members should contact Chris Horhan or Tracy Brown with your requirements and needs. Thank you.